Why the minimum wage shouldn't be raised? The federal minimum wage started during the Great, Depe Great Depression in 1938 under President Franklin Roosevelt. It was init initially set to 25 cents per hour and has been increased by Congress 22 times, most recently in 2009 when it went from 65 to 75 to 65, $6.55 to $7.25 an hour. About 2.3% of the hourly paid working population earned the federal minimum wage or less. As I present today, I will be discussing how increasing the minimum wage could ne negatively affect low income and worker, low income workers and businesses and how it can affect consumer prices and how raising the minimum wage could lead to rise rise in oh, and how ra raising the minimum wage could lead to a rise in automation increasing the minimum wage would force businesses to lay off employees and raise unemployment levels Minimum wage increase from $7.25 to $10 would result in loss of over 500,000 jobs or more. Procon.org states, states, states that in a survey, survey of over 2,000 businesses and human resources professionals, 38% of employees who currently pay the minimum wage said that they would lay off employees if the minimum wage was increased to $10. 54% said they would decrease hiring, level, hire, hiring levels. Not only would many people lose their jobs, but some may also lose their businesses and have to close their companies as a whole. 60% of small businesses, business owners say that raising the minimum wage would result into them losing would result in them closing because of the actual loss of money they would be making. Jamie Richardson, vice president of the fast food change, fast food change White Castle says that the company would be forced to close almost half of its stores and let go thousands of workers if the federal minimum wage was raised to $15. Now some some might say that raising the minimum wage is way overdue, which may be true, but there are many consequences that overweigh the positives. Many believe that raising the minimum wage would be very helpful because they are getting paid more and the prices are already rising, but the minimum wage would increase the price of consumer goods by almost triple what it is already. A Purdue University study found that raising the wage of fast food restaurant employees to $15 or even $22 per hour would result in a price increase of 4.3% and 25% respectively, or a reduction in pr product size between 12% and 70. A hamburger, a ha for instance, a hamburger would be much smaller would be much smaller than it already is. Researchers stated that the price of a cup of coffee went up by 10 to 20% in Oakland, California after the, their minimum wage went up 36% to $12.25. $12.25. The report also found that 6.7% rise in coffee prices in Chicago after the minimum wage rose only to $10. Raising the minimum wage would also decrease employee benefits and increase tax payments. Duke, Us Duke University Duke University found that 40% of CFOs would reduce employees benefit employee benefits if the minimum wage were raised to $10 an hour. Full life care asked for a reduction in hours after the minimum wage was was raised. Citizen, citing concerns that the increase will mean they lose their housing sub, subsidies, yet they are still unable to afford market rate rents. Going on with this, if companies 
If companies cannot afford to pay a higher minimum wage for low-skilled services and service employees, they will use automation to avoid hiring people in those positions in those in those positions altogether. Oxford University researcher, researchers Carl Benedict Frey and Michael A. Osborne stated in 2013 that study that robots are already performing, performing many civil service tasks such as vacuuming, such as vacuuming, mopping, lawn, mowing, and gutter cleaning. And also robots are now learning and able to perform more complex tasks like food prepara preparation, healthcare, and commercial cleaning and elderly care. This will take away many jobs from people because, because of the way robots can do it instead of being, having to pay employees. Today I talked about how it negatively affects low, raising the minimum wage will negatively affect low income and work income workers and businesses, how it would negatively affect consumer prices and raising the minimum wage could lead to a rise in automation. Thank you.